Hi guys, it's Lee Dom's Apothec and today we're going to discuss alpha lipoic acid, which is an amazing antioxidant for your whole body. It's edible, taking it internally, but it's also amazing for your skin. It's the main ingredient in the Paracone MD line. It's amazing anti antioxidant, anti-aging, and it actually is very firming and smoothing to the skin. Penetrates deep in and actually recycles other antioxidants similar to glutathione, like vitamin C and E. Let's discuss. Okay, our alpha lipoic acid is just a more absorbable form uh, of alpha lipoic acid. And this is straight up pure alpha lipoic acid from bulk supplements. It gets really clumpy. It's apparently both water and oil soluble. And, and tastes crazy, it's, it's like spicy. It's, it's very, it balls up because of its, whoo! It's very active and that's why you wanna store it in a cool dry place, but it kinda gums up and you wanna make sure that it's, whoo! It's very sharp and spicy. Very sharp and spicy. So alpha, our alpha lipoic acid peaks, you know, in your young adult, brilliant bird of youth self, and then as you age, it, it continuously declines. That's why people, a lot of people take it, and it's good for your brain function, it's good for, it's a super antioxidant. It's a master antioxidant, so it recycles other antioxidants in your body. It's fat and water soluble, that's partly why it's such an amazing antioxidant. It's a universal antioxidant, that's what I meant, not a, master antioxidant maybe it's both but it's a universal antioxidant so it goes all around all, all these different cells in your body because it's water and fat soluble so this is the main ingredient in the pericone md line they're all about the alpha lipoic acid which you can get from bulk supplements pretty darn cheap so alpha lipoic acid lightens and brightens your skin and it's it's an exfoliant, it's an acid, so it actually exfoliates your skin gently. It's also an anti-inflammatory, it's, it's good for the elastic in your skin. It recycles all the antioxidants also in your skin, that's why it's so awesome. Okay, so alpha lipoic acid is responsible for several enzymes that engage in cellular production metabolism. And they did, there was half face studies, a lot of, that you read about where people with laser machines and also, why does it keep brightening? People's own opinion of their face, they saw a difference in wrinkles, especially eye wrinkles and lip you know, lines. So we're gonna make an eye cream, yo. You can also just put some in your regular old cream. Like I have this multi-lamular lamular cream from Bulk Actives, which they're in like Taiwan. So when you buy it from them, it's extreme, you know, most of the expense is in shipping. Anyways, you could just use any cream that you like and put some in. It's spicy, has an exfoliating, bright lines, brightens, improves your overall skin texture and color. Um, it works with the elasticity of your skin and very smoothing. And people, a lot of DIY forums that I frequent, they are really into it. Like even more of them with a Retin-A regimen. So that's exciting. So the R alpha lipoic acid is a more potent and readily available form of alpha lipoic acid, pharmaceutical grade, no additives in bulk supplements. It penetrates cheaper than other vitamins in your skin, so it helps with the elasticity of your skin. Guys, it's also known to breed, speed up brain function and other anti-aging big deals. It's, it works really well, like people use it as a nootropic, which I'm very into nootropics. It's used often in conjunction when you're taking it internally with acetyl L-carnitine, which we spoke of last week, right, with the B12, B3. So with alpha lipoic acid, these together, it works really with great with brain function and memory. It also helps with transferring glucose to your muscles, great for diabetes. And if you're trying to lose weight, it helps increase the utilization of fatty acids and energy production at the cellular level. It also really helps chelate, not chelate, chelate metals out of your body. That's what it's known for. So it's a master antioxidant, but somehow it chelates metals heavy metals out of your body. The dosage is about one six, 100 milligrams. Well, some people say 50 milligrams. That's a tiny amount. Bulk supplements suggest 100 milligrams, which is one six to 200 milligrams, which is one eighteenth teaspoon. And other people have, there's other protocols for like heart situations that have discussed three, 300 to 600 milligrams. 
So I don't know what the dosage, I would do 100. It's a little spoonful, 1 16th. That's a teeny tiny amount. Anyways, you maybe you just wanna buy it for skincare, which is a great idea. Let's do that. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how easily it just mixes with some, just a little bit of cream. Just gonna put some cream in here. This is just like a very basic cream. <laughs> Cause it's, that's gonna be the easiest way. I just wanna show you how easily, oh yeah. See, it's kind of a powder. There's definitely some that gets stuck in the sides of the, wall, the walls. Cause it kind of balls up if you just use it in water. All right, look, I'm gonna put some in here. You know, and just stir it up with my trusty specialized stirrer. And it dissolves so nicely, guys. Okay, see? So it just makes it kind of a yellow cream. That's one of the main ways you could do it is just mix it into a cream that you already like. You know, see? It's dissolved. Pretty good. I like it. Tingles on your face for the first, if you put a lot of alpha lipoic acid in it, you can, it tingles, which is nice because it feels like, oh, it's working. And you know, you might actually have some sloughing off of skin, this mixfoliation, if you will. So, but that will, as you use it, decrease. Okay, let's do it. So we're gonna make an eye balm with shea butter and our alpha lipoic acid and vitamin A, retinol palmitate, which because, uh, because alpha lipoic acid is unstable, retinol palmitate, vitamin A palmitate actually helps stabilize our alpha lipoic acid. Not neat. And because they're hard to solubilize, don't want a lot of other ingredients, I'm gonna manually do it with the marnel and pestle. Okay, so here we are. We have a tablespoon of shea butter. Fancy scale, look at that. We got our supers on. This thing comes off and on. It's a little facilitator bucket, measuring bucket. And then you put, I'm gonna put something else on. Paper, because it's easier. And then I have to tar it, so I'm gonna put push tar, and that makes it go down to zero because this weighs something. And then we're gonna put our point to close enough. Okay, now what we're gonna do, so that's our alpha lipoic acid. Slide out uh, alpha lipoic acid. Mm -hmm. We're gonna mush it around. Mix it in. Because these actives are difficult to mix in, I find just manually mushing it seems to help. Oh yeah. Okay, so now we're gonna measure our vitamin A. Tar it. Oh, it's already tarred. Our point two of that. Oh, so close. Did you see? Okay, here we are. Here, let's tap it in like this. Oh. Very close, very close. Excellent. Before I put in twice as much alpha lipoic acid, and it did sting. And, I'm, you know, it was a little bit irritating. I don't think that's advantageous. So I'll put it half in. You can test the gritty. Oh my hand looks terrible this way. Okay guys, here's our balm. Mm. You know, it just smells like shea butter, which I'm not going to put any essential oil in it because it's such a small amount and I don't want like essential oils in my eyeball. Then I'm just gonna put this in like a little fabulous little jar mm -hmm. yeah scoop it in and have an eye balm and just put it around here and when I first made this it was very stingy like that you could really feel the alpha lipoic acid and I still actually can you can feel alpha lipoic acid working guys that's really exciting put it around your neck neck balm dude lift that get your neck elasticity happening so cool, so you can do that, or you can just put it in your, in a lotion that you already have, that you like, 
boosting it. It's an alpha-lipoic acid booster and it readily dissolves in lotions. You know, you just have to mix it well. Sometimes you'll get a little balling up. When you try and do it in oil, it just doesn't dissolve very completely, you know? And next time, we'll make an alpha-lipoic body lotion, darlings. Yes, so when you're, when you're doing the emulsifying, when you're heating up your water, you got your emulsifier, you need an emulsifier, we'll get an emulsifier and do that. And it'll be a tightening, a physical tightening lotion. How about that, a whole body tightening lotion, huh? And if you like that video, guys, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And you guys should check out our alpha lipoic acid. Oh, I feel it tingling. I feel it tingling. It's neat. I like it. Hydrating. If it's too strong, put less in. At least from what I've read, a lot of people, I haven't had a lot of shedding, but some people can have a lot of exfoliation of your skin, you know, some skin flakes, kind of like a Retin-A. And your skin will get more and more used to it. It penetrates, because it penetrates deep into your skin. And uh, that's why I'm so excited about it. That's why I'm so excited about it. And you can take it internally. Not neat. Bulk supplements has cheap, very pure supply, darlings. Yeah, it's so neat how you can feel it. I can feel it. <gasps> there you go, guys. So if you like that video and you have any other recipes with alpha lipoic acid you want to share, please share in the comments because I'm into it. I want to try a lot of this. It's very good anti-aging ingredient that you need to assimilate into your regimen, I'm telling you. Even if you just pour it into, you know, another cream. Okay, honey? And if you like that video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And have a wonderful evening, darlings. Ciao. Both water. Why does it keep doing that? People just feeling like um it's very spicy um so i should get some water now <clears throat> and so it's